Question 9, part A. The probability scale shows the probability that a spinner will land on red. It also shows the probability that the spinner will land on blue. Tony says the spinner is more likely to run, land on blue than on red. Is he right? Explain your answer. It's another one of these where we have to explain it, otherwise we won't get a mark. Well, looking at the probability scale, we have 0, which represents that something can't happen, and 1, that it will definitely happen. Red is halfway, so there's an even chance that will happen. And red is somewhere near the bottom, so blue is less likely to happen. So we have to again say no to answer the question. No, he's not right. It's less likely. So blue is less likely. Has that explained our answer? Not really. But we can just say, say give say a fact that the fraction is lower as the probability is smaller. We could also have said that it's further left on our line, but I believe that explains the question well enough. Part B says there are three white counters and four black counters in a box. Jenny is going to take a random counter from the box. Write down the probability that Jenny will take a black counter. Well, we know that there are four black counters, and that's going to be out of the total, which is seven. So the probability is four over seven. Part two says write down the probability that Jenny will take a yellow counter. Well, there are no yellow counters in the box, so the probability is just 0. This can also be given as a probability of 0 over 7. Either answer would do.